Okay, so on to question three is another electron configuration question. What is the electron configuration for an aluminum ion, uh, aluminum three plus? So whenever I have uh, electron configurations that require an ion, I like to first write down the electron configuration of the atom, uh, of the neutral atom. So in the case of aluminum, uh, let's start from hydrogen and then go across to get its electron configuration. So for aluminum, it is found here. And it just goes 1s2, 2s2, going to 2p6, and then 3s2. And then finally, 3p1. And we can also write down the short and configuration. Uh, the nearest noble gas that comes before aluminum is neon. So I can write neon in square brackets. And then continuing on, 3 3s2, 3p1. Okay, so now the question asks for the electron configuration of aluminum 3 plus. So when you have 3 plus, since uh, electrons are negatively charged, this means that three electrons were removed. So now, let's look at the electron configuration of just regular aluminum, and then we're going to take away three electrons. So basically the last two parts there. So now, its new electron configuration is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6. Or, it just has the same electron configuration as neon. Okay, so let's see what the junior tutor said. To answer this, we need to determine first the electron configuration of the elemental aluminum. By inspecting the periodic table, aluminum belongs to period 3, group 13, and has an atomic number equal to 13. The atomic number tells us that the neutral form of aluminum must account for a total of 13 electrons. Therefore, the configuration of aluminum in elemental form would be 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p1. Now we have the aluminum ion aluminum 3 plus. 3 plus here means that aluminum loses three electrons from its outermost energy shell. In this case, the three electrons lost would come from the third energy shell, one from the 3p orbital, so shown here, and then two from the 3s orbital, which was this one. This means the electron configuration would be 1s2, 2s2, 2p6. Yep, so I can verify that this solution is correct. On to...